Welcome back, everybody. It's 722, an Indianapolis family-owned business working to help medical workers on the front lines of the coronavirus crisis are using their engineering knowledge, manufacturing capabilities, and plastic resources to create face shields. And joining me right now is Rich Mickle, owner of DM Sales and Engineering. Hey, so good to have you here. I think we have to get you on the phone. We were having some problems with our uh, Zoom. How are you this morning? And tell me how this came to be. Well, basically, uh, I, like everybody else, started seeing on TV uh, healthcare workers uh, desperately needing some PPE. And uh, we decided that we had the capability of doing that and we could actually help. And we looked and repurposed some raw plastic materials since we're in the plastics industry and decided that, uh, hey, let's go ahead and make face shields. We can do that. So we tooled up and were able to do it uh, within 48 hours and start producing those. 48 hours. What has it been like so far? How many have you been able to produce and are you actually able to get them into the hands of those that need them? Yes, we've produced over a thousand and we continue to produce them and uh, we are sourcing them out, uh, giving them out to local hospitals and also any kind of charitable organizations that need to have face shields. Uh, case in point, we uh, just did a shipment to uh, Family Development Services who's helping Head Start. Uh, they didn't have any kind of PPE and uh, they, uh, I had known someone that worked for them and uh, I said hey can we help you out and they said yeah we'd love to have some so we were able to give them some uh, yesterday we delivered to uh, Johnson Memorial Health uh, some additional face shields and before that community health and then also with community health we were able to give them over a mile of elastic that they needed for the volunteers who were making uh, actual face masks. Wow. I mean, just think about how all of these different businesses are using their knowledge then in different ways to help in this. Tell me how you guys are doing financially um, as far as, you know, with this crisis and, you know, trying to stay afloat and, and keeping your employees there. Well, we're, we've kept all of our full-time employees and have been part-time employees fully employed. Uh, they haven't lost hours or anything else like that. Uh, that's number one. Uh, number two, uh, as all small businesses or even large businesses right now, there's been a financial impact, of course. Mm -hmm. I, I would say that probably sales have dropped about 35 uh, percent. But uh, again, uh, we're able to weather the storm. Uh, we also think that uh, at, during times like this, you have to give back to the community. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're trying to do with the face shields. Uh, I'm hopeful for the uh, future of the economy. Hopefully, once they get the stimulus stuff into you know people's hands, that's going to help tremendously. Hey, thank you so much. We sure do appreciate it. Good luck to you. Okay, and if you thanks. would like more information on the work DM Sales and Engineering is doing, maybe you can use them for a project since they're giving back. We have that information at fox59.com/links.